For anybody that's planning on getting wings, and I've said this before, man, and this isn't even a hot, this isn't a hot take, this is facts. I want that bone in. I want all the meat. Give me that meat. Hey, yo, what the fuck? Boned in wings. Getting boned is way better than boneless. Boneless is literally glorified chicken nuggets. But if I'm going out to a restaurant to eat glorified chicken nuggets, you're going to get the ranch and you're just going to dunk it and be respectful. You're going to be respectful when you're eating the bone. Wait, wait a minute. But boned in is clearly better. But you have to get it to go so you can go home and actually eat very messy and disgusting and vile and not have to feel like you're you know not eating proper or like anything like that you know what i'm saying you know what i'm saying where i can dunk that meat that long boned up meat into some white creamy sauce you know what I'm saying? Oh shit! Look at look at this, the streamer. Who is it? I follow you. Do you? Don't lie to me, sir. I will let you win this gulag if you're serious. I'm not joking, sir. The movement guy. The movement guy. Hey, I, all right. Listen, listen. I'm not gonna kill you. All right. Listen, go crazy, baby. Go crazy. He said the movement guy. He better freaking show me something. Boneless is better. New trucker, I get it, man. You're trying to be different. Blue cheese gang, Ralphie, you have five seconds to say April Fools or mate, whatever. You, if you are gonna choose blue cheese over ranch with wings, you don't belong in this amazing community. Disrespectfully. If you're going to choose that, I don't want you here. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Please. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Okay. Listen, I'm joking. I'm not Joe King. I'm Joe Woe. Oh, brother. This guy stinks. I've never had ranch before. Okay, never mind. I apologize. Then, hey, listen. That's on me right there. That is on me. I apologize. I'll, I take it back. This guy's a little demon. A little, 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 little demon ass. Got a little demon on our hands. Bone in or bone out wing. She ox. It depends where we are. Where are we? Are we at a restaurant or am I at home in the comfort of my own home? It depends. There's not one answer fits all. Um, yo, Ash would have gifted tier one to rip. No. Why is it a helmet cam? Guys, we're, okay. We're past the topic at hand here. What are we getting for food together? Are we getting tacos? Are we getting McDonald's? I don't want McDonald's, actually. Change that thought. Are we getting Chipotle? That's always solid. We feeling some Jersey Mike subs, potential little Jersey Mike's. Little sub action. Five guys would be incredible. And then the burger place. What? Okay, I'm seeing a lot of tacos. We feeling Bojangles? Number 13 to Mike's way. Who is Mike and who is number 13? Shake Shack? Okay, we can't go burger because if I get... Okay, if it's in third party again, I'm about to yank that helmet cam off of this guy. Um, We can't go burger because if I get a burger, I'm going to knock out cold. I'm gonna knock out. Wendy's. Wendy's. <laughs> guys, seriously, guys, stop playing around. Stop, guys, we gotta stop. Arby's. Yo, Bane, you did not just type Arby's and thought that that would just get scrolled past and we're gonna let that slide. There's no shot. You just typed Arby's and you thought that all of us would just like pretend that you didn't type it and we would let that slide. Joe doesn't even like sushi, so I'm crying. Sushi's beyond mid. And I knew that sushi was mid. I'm muting the game sound so I can speak this and look into the camera when I say this. 
I knew that sushi was beyond mid, beyond absolutely below average food extravaganza entrees because people that are sushi lovers, mind you, you are eating something for the taste, for the, for the taste buds to be tingling, for the taste buds to get creamy. I knew sushi was chalk before I even tried it because people that love sushi say, Joe, you go get sushi for the experience. For the experience. And that's how I knew that it was beyond mid before I even tried it. And then I tried it and it was mid. People say for the experience. I'm going to Waffle House and the dirtier the Waffle House floor is, the more freaking piles of sweat and everything else that's in that Waffle House floor, the better that food's gonna be. Okay, I don't go there for the experience of the Waffle House. I go to get my taste buds creamy. What do you mean by that? You don't go for the experience to have sushi, okay? All right. The dirtier that Waffle House, the better it's gonna be. And if you know, you know, and if you don't, it's all good. You've been eating some cheap sushi. Initial, listen, man, I'm not even trying to flex. This is a non-flex, because I, dang. Wait, what is going on? Okay, this is a non-flex because I didn't even pay for it, okay? I, okay, so this is not a flex. I'm just saying. I've had some of the best sushi there is. I've been to the Nobu's. I've been to the Malibu Nobu. I, I've been to those places, man. And it's mid. And it's mid. I'm not talking gas station 7-Eleven sushi. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking to the best of the best, supposedly. And it's mid. Why get sushi when you can stay home for a creamy experience for free. Hold up. Wait a minute. You gotta eat that sushi for the gains, bro. Sushi ain't giving me no gains, bro. All right. Okay, guys. What am I getting, though, actually? Kind of leaning, leaning towards some tacos right now. Joe, Joe with them toddler taste buds. Taste, I can't even talk. Taste buds. See, that's... Now we're getting... Come on. The seaweed gains. That's what I'm saying. Y'all are out here freaking herbivores. Just smacking on some grass, acting like it's good. Stop it. Stop it. Yo, Metaspect, what's good, baby? What's up, Joe? First time chatter. Metaspect. I know that your first time chatting was, what's up, Joe? And you seem like an incredible individual. But your entire career here stands on one take. Your entire career stands on this one take, yes or no. Do you like sushi, Metatech? It's a yes or no answer. You're going from a first time chatter, we're putting you on the spot. Can you handle the pressure? Can you handle, handle the pressure? Meta, don't act like, don't act like that you're not at the freaking setup right now. We know that you're at the setup right now. Yo, this guy, I'm. What the? Okay, I've come to a cons. Ooh. I kind of want to try. Okay, hear me out. I kind of want to try some teriyaki chicken and some yum yum sauce. The problem is it's got a 2.7 stars. And it may give me the squirts, but I'm telling you, that yum yum sauce and some teriyaki chicken goes crazy. Some fried rice, insane. That's a risk that you have to decide if it's worth taking. That's the creamy squirts. That is the creamy ones. You're gonna be crying on the toilet bowl? Okay, fine. Fine. The gym will not like me tomorrow, and we're doing legs tomorrow, so I may squat. Try, try to squeeze one out. Mid squat short. I gotta be honest with you. The mid squat short. Okay, we're not gonna do that. 2.7 stars is me a little bit nervous. I gotta keep it a buck. Not a lot is looking appealing right now. Ooh, some spaghetti would go crazy too. 
To get bread in the gym yet? I can't get that guy out the house, man. I think I'm getting that guy in the gym. Do you like Alfredo or Marinara better? Bubs, I don't really have a choice. I'm gonna be honest. I don't really have a choice. They're both good. Okay, I'm going to search spaghetti and see what comes up. All these have delivery fees, man. None of these places have $0 delivery, man. The cheapest fee is $3.99 for a exclusive Eats on Uber Eats. I, I don't even know what that means. I'm going to be honest. This place is open until 11 o'clock, and it's called Sal's Pizza Factory. That's yeah, got to be good, right? A guy named Sal, he's got to be Italian. He's got to be goaded. Hmm. The first red flag, the first red flag of this place is that they have everything. They have like cheeseburgers and stuff. Red flag number one. If you are a restaurant that is specializing in something and you have everything, that's low key sus. That raises a red flag, okay? They got cheeseburgers, like everything. They have a chicken parm sandwich. The other thing I don't like is there's no pictures. Let's try that. Chicken parm Sammy. Do we get la lasagna? Baked ziti. Eggplant parm. That sounds mid. Eggplant rollatini. Baked ziti sicilian manicotti. Four pasta dishes, chicken alfredo, ravioli, carbonara, bola. I, I literally don't know what half this stuff is. I, I, I don't know what half this stuff is. But look, wait a minute, guys. We have a game to win. Okay. Okay. If I win this game, sushi is mid. We all agree, correct? Bet. If not, I'll try sushi on stream whenever you guys want from whatever restaurant y'all choose. Deal or no deal? I'm literally going to start hacking right now. I'm hacking. Guys, I'm ratting for a win. I don't care. Sushi is so bad. This is what freaking sushi is. Right here. Question also. How many people still use toilet paper? Because if you're not using wet wipes, your booty cheeks smell. Your booty is nasty. And I don't want to call you out, but your freaking butt cheeks are disgusting. I rest my case. Now, I got to be honest. Hold that thought. Gas is closing. Get to the new safe zone. It's down to 10. You can win this. Come here, little bro, you little, you little stinker. You little stinker. I kind of ran out of toilet paper in here, bro. You got any extra? Yo. Help. I'm stuck. Yo. I'm stuck on the toilet, bro. Are you actually I... I ain't got no toilet paper in here, bro. Daddy's home, little buddy. <laughs> Daddy's home, little buddy. <laughs> Wait, where are my smokes? Oh, shoot. What the? Oh, 
Hey, you're with me. Thank you guys for coming to my TED Talk. I appreciate it. Enjoy your night. Little bros.